So, what is up, fellow YouTube content creators, YouTube channel owners, YouTube sensations, whatever the case may be. Uh, I haven't done a, a vlog from my vehicle, my car, my Jeep, uh, in quite some time. Um, I was hating on my Volkswagen one of the few times I was talking, and as you can see, I am not in my, my Volkswagen right now. I'm in my good old faithful standby, which is a a 2004 Jeep Grand Cherokee that's got um, 219,637 miles on it. Um, I'm afraid to get rid of this car because it's the perfect backup vehicle for anybody in my family. Um, something I want to talk about, and uh, I, I don't know how this is going to go over, and really I don't care because like I even mentioned previously, my YouTube channel is really for my entertainment. I mean, I appreciate anybody who subscribes to the channel and comments on my videos and interacts with me uh, because of videos that I post or because of comments that I post on your videos. But um, the interesting enough, uh, I started this off uh, kayak fishing and I had some metal detecting videos I've taken out on uh, metal detecting trips and then um, I met up with a couple of guys here in the my local area and decided well I might as well start a motor vlogging channel. I mean, it seems fun. There's a lot of motorcyclists out there that do the same thing, and it'll be an, uh, inter uh, the opportunity to interact with other uh, motorcyclists. Well, I did that. I'm, I'm not the best uh, at uploading videos consistently. That is what it is. But uh, so I changed the motor vlogging channel from Ron C's Motor Vlogs to Ron C A Day in the Life because I wanted to add other other content uh, more than just the motor vlogs because. You know, I, you got to face the truth that my world does not revolve around my motorcycle. I like to ride. I just don't ride it as often as a lot of people uh, for various reasons that, you know, I'm sure we can all have an excuse and a reason to ride or not to ride. So, uh, so I changed it to Ron C. A Day in the Life and I started recording uh, just trips that the wife and I would do to antique malls, uh, shopping trips, uh, hiking, things like that. And that was fun. And uh, if you look back at my videos, the motor vlog videos typically have 30 to 40 views, maybe 50, 60 sometimes. Um, I got a couple, one of the one of the kayaking trips the wife and I went on in Rappahannock River got a little bit over 100 views. Now keep in mind, I've got just over 100 subscribers. And um, so to get 100 views is pretty huge to me. I mean, that means that potentially everybody who's a subscriber to me watch that video so uh, I incorporated another one another video uh, with the neck knife that I modified and uh, interestingly enough that video um, accumulated over 230 views all right that was pretty cool you know and uh, I went in the most recent video I did was on the uh, Maxpedition EDC pouch with all the little toolkits I carry in my backpack. That was, I think I published that on the 13th. I'm not 100% sure, I'll go back and check. But So 10 to 12 days. I've already gotten, and this is huge for me, and I know a lot of guys, this is nothing. They have, you know, thousands of views to, within 24 hours of posting a video. But for me to have, I think that video is, it's not quite at 600 views, but the last time I checked it, which was yesterday, I believe, it was at 570 some odd views. Whoa, you know, and um, so that's probably the subject of more videos to come. I mean, it's, that's another part of who I am, and you know, to do a Ron C a Day in a Life YouTube channel, it only makes sense to incorporate things that are part of my life and you know that little Maxpedition EDC pouch is part of it you know I, I carry items on my my person every day that are probably worthy of a video uh, the, the the rest of the, the other contents of that backpack would, would probably be worthy of a video albeit uh, people who aren't into being uh, prepared for emergencies or, or situations where you might be required to have a tool it might scoff or laugh at it, but that's fine. Everybody has their thing, you know. And I, I, it, you know, live and let live is how I am. So, just giving everybody a warning and a heads up. If you don't like, uh, 
camping type of videos or survival type of videos or bushcrafting types of videos, camping, kayaking, fishing, metal detecting, out and about, that's, and, and with some motorcycles vlogging thrown in there, this is probably the direction my channel's going. And you know, we all do our thing and we all upload videos when we want to. At least, probably 99% of the people that I follow uh, aren't in this for the money. I mean, we, we if you're like me, you do it for the pure entertainment and interacting with like-minded people around the world. And that's what I'm shooting for. Uh, another uh, vlogger that I follow, uh, and a lot of my subscribers probably follow him maybe as well, is Reggie with two G's. Uh, he started off, the, the, when I started watching him, it was just uh, Reggie with two G's. It was a strictly a motor vlogging channel. And then he started another channel called Reggie's Daily Vlogs, where he was doing a daily vlog. And, and I cannot imagine trying to um, come up with enough content during the day, every day, to make a vlog, and then editing that every night and uploading it. So it's uh, published the next day. Uh, so kudos to you, Reggie, for that. So then he merged his motor vlogging channel and his daily vlogs channel. And, uh, but just the other day, he posted a video saying that he was ending the daily vlog, and I, I completely understand it. I mean, he was good at it. Um, he was able to stay upbeat with his vlogs, and even though his, um, he, you know, he's uh, in the landscaping business, and uh, he's a manager there, and he, he really shared a, a, a big part of his life with everybody. And to be able to be upbeat and record every day, uh, I, I, I don't know how you could do it. I thought about how I could do it. I'm like, well, number one, I can't record where I work. I mean, I could, but it's, it's to me, it's the same thing every day. You know, I unfortunately, uh, I do spend a lot of time sitting at my desk, uh, but it is what it is. So anyway, that's what a direction I'm heading in with my channel, and I just want to give everybody a heads up. Um, I enjoyed a lot of the, all the feedback I get, positive or negative. Nobody's going to hurt my feelings because I really don't give two shits. So, love you guys. Mean it. Uh, have a good one.